Hello again, friends and onlookers. Conrad Zerman here once again with my lovely wife, Katrina. Hi, everybody. Out. Hey, and uh, uh, I'm going to play a little Tesla Grod. Now, this uh, this just came out. I'm playing a, uh, a pre-release build, but I don't think anything will have changed, really. Um, so we're just going to start from the beginning and, and just play a little bit of this. When is the release? Uh, it's in a couple of days from now. But cool. I, but this isn't coming out until the day this comes out, so it's now. Cool. So today. Yes. <laughs> Maybe yesterday. No, it's today. It'll be today. Okay, it'll be today. Wow, I'm in the future. It's like time. That's all the theme is. The theme is time. It's Tesla. All right, I'm gonna let you talk. Okay. No, it's it's not. It's it's magnetism and electricity. Time, man. Time. No. I tried. So. I've already played through this like twice because I think it's freaking awesome. But uh, as you can see, there's a, an invading group of, of people. Got our little boy and a mother at the window pointing forward. So pretty. Wow, this is gameplay? Yeah, this is straight gameplay right out the beginning. It doesn't... Wow. It's beautiful. It's like a painting. Mm-hmm. That's really lovely. Also, it's really cool that you, like, climb rooftops. And yes, stuff, yes. You know? so climbing rooftops, and, uh, I mean, there are these guys that are on the ground that will chase me if they see me, and we'll run into uh -huh. one of them here shortly. Um, I love that background. Yeah. It's that just beautiful. The castle is great. Oh, wow. didn't quite make it. That's all right. couple of big scales there thrones on them gates in the water oh the water is so well done it's just gorgeous there's a lot going on here yes there is <laughs> um in more ways than one well it's just what's one of the things i really appreciate about this game is that oh. there's no dialogue in it there is there's no text None anywhere in this game all? But it conveys actually a a fairly great story for for a game about a, a prophecy and warring kingdoms, and it does it in a really interesting and entirely text-free manner. Oh, I would not have thought you could go through that building. Wow! Look at those rooftops. Goodness. I mean, in some ways, I find that a little bit creepy, just because I think that not talking is a little creepy, but it's beautiful. Well, there's just never any need for it. Really? There's there's absolutely no time at which I think the story would be better served by the inclusion of dialogue. Wow. Wow, scary dude. Like, there is, like, this guy that's chasing behind me now, he's a central figure in, in the story. Really? Uh, and I won't say much more than that, but uh, he, he becomes very, very important to it. And, again, Ooh, nobody, there's no exchange of conversation between your character and him, but there is a sort of tangible relationship, wow. uh, a rivalry thing that, that's kind of interesting. Oh, dead guy. Dead guy. Hooded dead guy. And that guy's up there. Or, yeah, he just ran in the background. Yeah, I saw that. Ooh. Instructions on how to play the game. Ha ha ha. How this works. Touch that. Blow stuff. So we got our little blue drone guy here. And he puts a blue aura around me. And then, and then I'm repelled by blue. Ah, repelled. That makes sense. Mm -hmm. Like magnets. Got it. Like magnets. How do they work? I figured it out. <laughs> yes, you get a blue aura on you. Yep. <laughs> And so See, now here, this is like an automated the system. Around. The little drones are, are walking through and ah. alternately raising and lowering them by changing the uh, the polarity. Oh, and you want to go up there. Oh, mm -hmm. my God. Brilliant. Hello, shiny thing. It's freaking Nabby. Oh, Let's no. Let's get her. <laughs> Not again. <laughs> Not this I'm time. I'm just killing the thing outright <laughs> this time. And got me a little gauntlet. Oh. Oh, I didn't even notice the HUD. Yep, Wait, there's did that a just HUD. happen now? That just popped up now because oh, I okay, got that. Oh, okay, good. All right, just yeah. checking. I was like, whoa. 
Also, even that's very painterly. I dig it. Oh. Oh. Yup. Goodness. And so now I punch with all the colors of the wind. What? You're, you're Pocahontas? Punch it. Boom. Punch a hot. So the opposite colors attract each other. So I turn that blue. I turn that red. I turn that red. Oh, brilliant. Okay. Simple okay. tutorial puzzle. Yeah. What's that? That's a flower. It's like the bot. Okay. Does that. Oh, but there's a but wall. But there's a wall. So we have to go that way. Yes, oh, this sad. way we will go. Oh. Gotta clear the path. Whoa. You can punch in four directions. Okay. So you I can... would not have thought to punch that guy up top to make a bridge. Well, that's why oh, it has the little has fist little over fist it to thing. let yep, you know that that's something now. you can do. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Woo. Okay. And now we punch that little one there and, and it attracted up to the top so the little bot guy can go and turn this one over here blue oh, cute. which okay. will raise this door huh and then i'll use this one as an elevator by turning it blue brilliant and then turn red from that and be repelled from the floor below see it's all very simple this is actually mm -hmm. i'm impressed and it just you know it does sort of build upon its elements well not too fast or too much or whatever happens. No. You. Well, it, it never gets overwhelming either uh, in terms of... Ooh, that guy looks scary. ...what it demands of you. There are some optional challenges, semi-optional uh -huh. challenges, um, uh -huh. that are very difficult. Uh, the one thing I don't understand is if you're running around in sort of, you know, Russia type stuff with so baddies where are you now what is going on with that it's just you don't really question it it's i'm just... well i'm in a tower in the middle of the town that i was living in very clearly you're the little swaddling lad that's brought in you know as you saw in the title yes. sequence yeah and he you someone brought you into the house wearing the colors of the people who were dead in the foyer so it would stand to reason that somehow related to that, this is some sort of base or something for them. Okay. A little bit. I didn't quite get all of that on my own, just by looking. But... Well, it, some of it uh, doesn't... You know, you, it, there's a lot of detail to take in. And I have an advantage of having seen this through to the end already. And... True. Now that's new. Oh, it's the same principle. I... It's so out of the box for me. It's in a lot of ways. Yeah, you know, just attracted to the thing on the roof because you're the opposite color of it. Right. All right, all right. Start walking, pal. No. <laughs> no. Ah. Oh. Punch, punch, punch. Really, what I should be doing is just trying not to get hit by them. But. But pushing them off the edge like that seems to have... Oh. Uh, damn it. Okay, so those are instant death? Yeah, there's all, all death in this is instant. You can't take... And then where do you go after? You just... It checkpoints. Checkpoint, got Yeah, it. and it checkpoints okay. anytime you enter a room. So, and sometimes multiple times within a room if you're... Uh, uh, if the room is large. So it's pretty uh, reasonable. That's good at least. That's reasonable. I'm trying to rush a bit in this and that's causing me problems. I need to be more careful. I can imagine oh. that eventually going through rooms like that, uh, you know, you, you definitely may have to do it several times just to get used to the patterns and all that. Oh, sure. Because of the way that the magnets pull you, I could... Ha ha, I, I got them both going in the same direction. Oh, Fudge monkey, I almost... Uh, oh, I did do it again. Cool. <laughs> cool, go me. Let's see how many times I can screw this up. It's not even that hard. The hard stuff comes much later. Not much later, though. The game only takes about six hours to finish. Right. Yeah, just don't worry about pushing them off. Well, I didn't want to push them off in the first place. I wanted oh. to avoid them. I just kept getting hit. Okay, I love this. Ready? Whee! Whoa! Whoa! Dude, that was 
That's crazy. There's a return trip, too. I'll die. Come here. Whee! Oh, snap. That's cool. Yeah. Uh oh. Oh, damn it. Come on. <laughs> Hadn't re didn't respawn. There we go. That's fun. Yeah, it's just fun. It's a magnetic magic carpet. It's the hoverboard. Or a hoverboard, sorry. <laughs> okay, little boy. <laughs> Why every kid wants a hoverboard. <laughs> I didn't. Whoa, what's that? Hey there, big fella. He kind of looks like a... A big poppy. Who's a big poppy? <laughs> Where's his ears? Scratch your blind ears. I don't think that would work very well. Ah! Oh, he does not look happy. Indigestion! <laughs> Ah, it's getting faster. Ah. Yes, eat. He's eat. allergic to magnets. <laughs> well, okay, I think we get one more in there and then he gets mad again. And, you know, like many, many bosses in many, many games like this, it's a three step process. All right. Unfortunately, and this is like the one real criticism I have about this game, uh -huh. is that it's just you do the same action oh. three times. Uh, it doesn't really add anything. I mean, it, it, there's a little bit of, of a difficulty increase, but it's not significant. Like, now it's just that the conveyor belt is fast all the time. Right. It's not Got that... It. There's no new pattern to learn or new... Uh, use of ability or something like that. Which, I mean, it, it's alright. It's not... That's pretty stock ah. standard stuff. It's hard to get too upset. That sure. was a fairly anticlimactic end, too. Yeah, it was. Yeah. I felt a little sad for him. Though. He probably just went to sleep. Oh. <laughs> the big sleep. Oh. But ah. I got new shoes. Wait, what? those little black guys. Whoa! That's what my new shoes do. Jeez, I want those shoes. Yeah, those are neat shoes. That's fantastic. Hi! Hello! Oh my god, that's amazing! <laughs> yeah. Okay, so I have a question for you then. Uh-huh. Does this have anything to do with Tesla aside from magnets? No. Okay. <laughs> I no. was just checking. Why, why Whoa! It... You can jump now! Yes. Without jumping! Great distances. Dude! Sorry, that was just, that was, blew my mind. That was amazing. Whoa. You are magic. I am magic! Woo! Wow. Isn't that cool? That is so cool. Yeah, it's fun. Wait, what fun. was that mural? Oh, you want to see the mural? Yeah, we can go back. Huh. Driving, it looks like they domesticated these b beasts for use in hunting. Beasties. Or, yeah. Whoever the hooded guys are. Who presumably own this joint. Oh, right. Got it. Oh, that looks dangerous. Doesn't matter. Nope. Wow, that was amazing. I'm so impressed. It's pretty cool. I'm shocked by your powers of magnetism. And now this aura actually draws the little light guys to me, which is kind of neat. It makes it, it easier to see. Uh-huh. Let's not confuse that with, like, I have any freaking clue where I am. <laughs> Just follow the lights. Into the light, Conrad. Into the light. I'm thinking I'll play this up to, like, the second boss, which actually isn't that far away at this point. Really? Yeah. It's not a very long game, and I know exactly what I'm doing to a certain extent, which is kind of speeding it up. Oh. These little scroll things up here, they're oh. collectibles. There's 36 of them in the game, and uh, normally, you know, you think of a collectible as being 
an optional thing, but you actually need about half of them to even finish. And so I just didn't collect them at all the first time I played, thinking, oh, I'll get back to them and do full completion later. Yeah. Uh, came, then came to find out that I was totally lost and had no idea what to do next, because the only thing to do was to collect them. And Oh. Yeah. And oh, go through the door that is there, requiring you to have a certain number of them, which in lots of oh. other games would be a totally optional bonus area, and but hence was not? disregarded by me. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Huh. I was a little surprised, but that's okay. Right? Huh. Okay, now we're climbing up, practicing our air dash. Very well. Well, it's pretty easy, and the game's fairly forgiving on the ledges. Okay. Because it's also, you know, that's one good. of those you're gonna die if you take a hit games. We. Okay. I'll get this one because it's easy. See? That was easy. 14 to go. <laughs> Climb up here. Oh, this was one of the first, like, aerial things that are interesting. Like, I'm going to hit this and it's going to bounce me. Oh. Whoa. But then I have to dash over to the, uh... Oh, I'm glad I turned that lightning off now. Our cat is laying down on the cord of the headphones that we're using. Because he is uh, special. <laughs> He's a very special kitty. He just wants to be involved. Yeah. Way to go, Ramses. <laughs> Way to get involved. Way to be social. So how do you how do you start that off? Like with a punch again? What? A dash or a punch or what? With the flowers? Like how do oh, you Oh no, start you just touch that? them and it, it does its thing. Because it's sitting oh. on those red blocks, I'm gonna get that red R and it's immediately gonna push me down. Got it. Oh. Well. And allows me to stick to the blue stuff up yeah. there on the top. You know, this is a very odd building. I, I don't know if uh Oh, Mystical towers else. are like that. Yeah, apparently. Apparently, they'll just hire anybody to be the architect <laughs> of a mystical tower. Weird, big magnetic beams? Totally. Yeah! Dead. No, that sounds like a totally efficient means of transportation. <laughs> Let's put one <laughs> big one running through the whole tower. Oh, crying out loud, Conrad. <laughs> it's ridiculous. I love it when you talk to yourself. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I could see those design specs, though. That would be pretty funny. All right, so I'm thinking big blue magnetic vortex right <laughs> here to offset weird, wobbly rock formations that are not natural. Oh, you know, here's <laughs> a thought. Maybe this is one of those situations where they, like, tried to correct some geological problem in the vicinity uh. and just, like like patched it with something and then that caused another problem that they then had to bounce and it just turned into this whole cluster of whatever it is do they explain it later do i, I don't... ever get closure um <laughs> well they they it's explained that the tower is built does that help oh that's great <laughs> built by wizards yeah that's the thing a committee of wizards should not be building towers it just doesn't no. make sense no design sense. Uh, in fact, whatsoever. actually, I think you'll Whoa! see it here. Weird. And this, so this will start an actual room. <laughs> this will start playing every time you like come into the room. Uh huh. And you know, if you stand still in front of it, you get this zoomed-in view of it. It's pretty cool. Huh. So here we got these uh, Vikings on the horizon. Quick, bolt people. Get to the ready rescue. To fight. Wizard men. Da, da, da. Wizard guy presents the uh, dude with a sword. The battle is afoot. I've got a cooler sword than you do. That's how those go down. Well, it did seem to call lightning from the heavens just now, so. <laughs> Case in point. <laughs> Badass. 
Ah, I took the sword, turned it into a crown, and made him king. You know, I don't trust that wizard guy. I think he's got a lot more power. That's how that goes down, isn't it, normally? That the whole, like, wizard person has more power than the king or whatever have you? That's how most of those stories go, yes. Yeah. Not this one. Okay. Whoa. Hey, have we been here before? Yes, this is the center of the town. Oh, whoa. Oh, I get it. What you were saying before was literal. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. No, I wasn't embellishing Sorry. on anything there. That was actually, yes. I did not realize. <laughs> Then why are there all these side rooms? Why don't they just, you know, use the middle one? It's like an elevator. Ooh, I suspect they probably did. Okay. Whoa, why is that block so big? Well, actually, it's teaching us something about mass. Is it? It is. <laughs> what? This game is educational? Uh, no, I I'm know. just kidding. <laughs> See, that was a mistake, what I just did. Uh-huh. Because by making it blue... It uh, attracted the thing that I was using as an elevator. Uh-huh. I opened a secret door. What? No one saw that coming. I didn't see that coming. Yeah. Zoop. <laughs> That's fun. Yeah, I like zipping around. Zip. Zip. Hmm, what should I do here? I don't know. You know, I could see how this game would be kind of fun to play with a kid, too. Yeah, it's totally... Which is a, co a compliment, I mean to say. I Absolutely. Don't mean it like... <laughs> it's not so complex that I don't think a kid could figure it out in any way. I mean, it's certainly... It's it's not play nowhere near as complex as, as, uh, as Super Metroid was. And, you know, I mean... Well, games were different back when I was a kid. But, <laughs> right. uh, but no, I mean, it's... And it's totally linear, really. Um... There's not a whole, there's not a whole lot of exploring of it to do. It, oh, okay. It's more or less a straight line. You, as long as you, you don't get lost in aren't encountering room. room. Yeah, as long as you continue to encounter rooms you've never seen before, you're pretty much following the course of the game. Right. Got a little garden here. It's so pretty. It is. You got and you can see the, the town city. below. Oh my yeah. god. That's incredible. My wife is now licking a Christmas card. Why'd you have to tell everybody? Because <laughs> I wanted them to know that we're the sort of people who send out Christmas cards. <laughs> I'm the kind of person that writes our Christmas par cards every year. If it was right. left up to you, they would not get sent. Whatever. We're the sort of people who send Christmas cards. <laughs> I married you we're to get your good traits. <laughs> This is why you get married, people. Yes. So that someone so that else, someone else will do the Christmas, Christmas cards. cards. It's true. That's it. <laughs> and he was a nice guy, you know. It was he was fine enough. Sure. <laughs> that ruse has worked long enough. <laughs> so it's time for you to start helping start out. Start making with the Christmas, Christmas cards. cards. <laughs> I can't get divorced. I'd have to start writing Christmas <laughs> cards. I don't have all those addresses. Oh, that was oh no. Poor. I think that's a pretty legitimate reason sure. not to get divorced. Works for me. Yep. <laughs> now I'm noticing all the little pictures in the background. Are they telling some kind of story? They are telling bits of story, yes. Because I see a big mechanical birdie dealio with the basket. Oh, look at that. And I'm also seeing uh, birds helping out with the trees, maybe, and, like, stuff. And there's the tree, and they're strong, and they're happy, and they're healthy, maybe. Looks that way. Lines. Seem pretty pleased. <laughs> well, you seem pleased. Smug, self-satisfied <laughs> bastards. <laughs> oh, look at us! We eat well! Aww. Terrible. <laughs> <laughs> Up this sort of vent pipe thing. Oh, well, that's new scenery. Like, that's all of a sudden very structured. Mm hmm. And, then, you know, trees. It's a big sense. tree that in here. That is a huge tree. This just, this isn't any, like, normal garden anymore. This is, like, a forest in a building. This is it, yeah, it's like an arboretum. Yeah. In a building. In a building. Like like 
biodome. This is not what I wanted. No, I'm just kidding. I mean, I'll Whoa. take it, but it's not something I... Oh, oh, damn. Or you won't take I it. I won't take it. That's fine. That was a long fall. Yeah, it's kind of a bitch. How did you not die? Uh, I don't think that that's really an issue. Wait, where are you now? Is this... I'm back down at the bottom of that big oh, thing. Oh, I get it. Okay. Yeah. See? Oh, that far. Yeah. Bummer. Bummer. All right. Sorry, it'll only take a second. <laughs> yeah. Up the pipe. Yay. Yeah, the thing I want is right up above us. I just can't get there yet. Or I just haven't gotten there yet. But I will. I'll get there. That's uh, the spirit. Yep. Yeah. Be positive. You'll oh. climb that tree eventually. Oh. That's like a good Hang in kid. there. Hang that's that's what that is. That's hang in there. Hang in there, little bot Tesla. Tesla game Tesla. Here we go. Ah! Oh! Oh! Found the bird! The bird! Now I get it. Oh, goodness. So, like many good boss encounters, you know, it's... You in in, in a lot of designs... Well, no. <laughs> you use the ability that you've most recently gained oh, to, to defeat it. That makes How sense. awesome is this game? <gasps> I'm in his chest! Oh! My God, that was awesome! Yeah, yeah. That's brilliant. Well, this, they this gave This is the you thing I wanted because, to play at least to get to. Yeah, well, they they showed you that because you went into those cages before, right? He just laid right. a little bird. He sure did. Whoops! Wow. Come here, bird. And it's all stormy and scary. It's a scary bird. <gasps> Oh, this is the tree from the drawings, uh -huh. too. Oh, that took me way too long to figure out. Yeah, sorry. yeah. Sorry. Sorry. You're cute, though. I know. It helps. <laughs> You're like, uh-uh. Not falling for it. Hey, he dropped two this time. I wonder uh -oh. how many he'll drop next time. Five. God, no. <laughs> Oh, good. No, he's pretty upset. Yeah, he is. I mean, technically they're making me do this four times, which uh. is kind of bullshit, but, you know. <laughs> they're making me do the avoid all of the projectiles three things three times, and I guess that's really what it's all about. Uh, I guess so. The big wavy thing. Right. Saw that coming. Yeah. Sucks to be you, bird. Oh, no. So, anyway, that's about... Oh, uh, let me... A little less than... Or maybe maybe about a third of Tesla Grad. Um, really? Yeah. In terms wow. of... It, but it gets it gets harder. It takes uh, a little bit longer to get through some of the later areas of it. But uh, um, that's the game. You should check it out. It's on Steam today. Uh, go go play it. It's really beautiful and fun. I, they can't hear you when you really? don't. Yeah, there's no way they heard that. Sorry. What did you say? I said in the future. Oh yes. The, the All right. Thanks. Future. Thanks. Thanks it's everyone for watching. Subscribe oh, to the yeah. channel if you could tolerate this, and uh, we will. Uh, we'll catch tolerate. you later. They yeah. love us. <laughs> or me. Just if it's just me, I'm okay with that. You guys, so long as you subscribe. Bye.